It's 3.30 in the morning on Halloween morning and downtown Vancouver is looking spectacular right now. There's nothing more cooler than being around the town when nobody's really up, well, except for those who haven't gone to bed yet. It's just raw, it's natural, it's real. Probably one of my favorite times to explore anywhere. Whether I'm out in some nice little quaint town or down in like the dirty grungy alleys of Vancouver on Halloween. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. So wicked. <laughs> I think we're done creeping around downtown Vancouver. It's about four in the morning right now. Um, I'm gonna see you guys when the sun is out because right now, well, I don't think the sun's coming out today. See you guys in a bit. Nice. How about that works? What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> this, is a, this is a Dairy Queen. Didn't I just buy that for your mom? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going Don't away to the island for a few weeks. Are you going to miss me? Nope. What? Alright, I'll see you in like a few weeks, okay? Bye! Yeah. That was super cool. Um, she's getting homeschooled by her mom, so she goes to work with her mom every day. So I came by today to snag her for a little ice cream on her lunch break. Pretty sweet. Hi, homie. Come on, move over, buddy. Whoa. That was pretty sweet. I realized on the last clip that I was stuffing my face with hot dogs at Ikea and I want to blame my inner fad kid but in that moment I was stuffing my hot dog in my mouth and I was recording it but I deleted the footage because then I realized it's my outer fad kid that's got the problem. The outer fad kid always blames the inner fad kid for the outer fad kid's problem. Shift blame man, it's always way more fun when you can blame somebody else instead of blaming yourself. Um, I actually tried Ikea's veggie hot dogs. Not bad, not great. Kind of cool though, I, I went in there like, veggie dogs? I'm in, let's try it. They were okay, I've had worse. I have a serious question for you. Do you have an inner fat kid? Or is daddy just blaming something that's not even there? He's like, dad, I don't, do you have an inner fat kid? Nope, I didn't think so. <laughs> well, there goes that. I can't blame that anymore. Anyway, Halloween night, we decided to come down to the beach here in Vancouver at Spanish Banks because I was here last year and it was fun down here last year because there's some like really big firework displays at some of the big fancy homes up the hill. Like they blocked the street off and had a huge deal. It was wicked. I'm sitting down here and I'm watching it. I'm like, oh, oh, oh. so we drove up there last year. Plus everybody was down here at the beach and literally I probably 20 people down the beach here and they all had like boxes of fireworks out here and they were just lighting them on the beach. So I decided, you know what? Hey, it's free entertainment. So we're going to park down here tonight and my home is sitting right there. And we're just going to enjoy Halloween by ourselves. We have our neighbor over there. All right, let's see how this ice situation is doing. <laughs> yeah, that's a fail. Still cold though. What a mess. 
seems like everybody around here is doing a little bit of housework in their vehicles. So I'm gonna do the same thing. <laughs> We're gonna make the freaking bed. I always hate leaving these things around. It looks like piss in a bottle. It's actually these little tang things. They're pretty good. <laughs> I like drinking water, but when you toss a bit of tang in it, I smash these things down like six of these in a day. And I don't buy these all new all the time. I do refill these. Look at this. Nice neighbor. I'm in here cleaning my house, make it look good, and my nice neighbor brings me a beer. Cheers, Cheers. Rob. Cheers. That's Rob. He doesn't like cameras, but sorry, man. You're stuck in it now. Little yoga there, buddy. <laughs> we got that battery out. Come on, focus. Seven watts charge on my phone. This thing has been super freaking handy. Because I pondered before when I had my house battery in the back to run an extension cord all the way up here to leave it back here just in case I needed to plug in something like my phone when I'm out here but this thing has been super freaking awesome I like it we've also gotten a few things from people in the mail over the past week we got a little toy drone from Steve thank you Steve from my patreon Cindy L she sent me this little bug zapper So cool. USB powered bug zapper. This is awesome. I'm actually gonna put this, I have a drawer right here. My camping drawer, which has just a bunch of camping stuff in there. And we're gonna stick that in the middle there. Super freaking cool. And with the rest of the mosquito stuff. Awesome. <laughs> I'm digging through my, digging through my cooler water so gross in there it's like icy cold soup <laughs> um this beer um my buddy dj chisel uh what's up man if you're watching he came out to one of the van meetups in vancouver the last one and brought me a six pack of this stuff it's from parallel 49 it's called trash panda <laughs> awesome so good bro thank you I'm gonna clean up some of this stuff. I bought ketchup today. It's gonna go in my sauce drawer. This drawer's <laughs> just miscellaneous sauces and stuff everywhere. This is go in the garbage. Sauces, sauces, and more sauces. Most of these things haven't even been opened yet. Hot chocolate in there, hot chocolate in there. Tim Hortons, Starbucks hot chocolate. Citation hot chocolate, <laughs> packs of hot chocolate. I like hot chocolate. Everybody seems to send me hot chocolate. I don't drink that much hot chocolate, but I got hot chocolate that'll last me forever. If you want to send me something, send me tequila. <laughs> All right, let's go in the garbage. With a little bit of cleaning, this van is looking mighty good. It looks so bad today. Laundry days in the van are the worst because it's like just a ruckus. Look at this thing. Ooh. <laughs> Disco, the house is clean, homie. We have a clean house tonight. Hey. <laughs> I think it's time to roll that music.
I just can't help but doing that sometimes. Just say, ah, something about looking at this place, just kind of, it's surreal. <laughs> this is my house. I am parked in front of, it's Vancouver, that's probably an $8 million home right there. If you were anywhere else in the world, that'd be like three quarters of a million <laughs> out here, that's probably eight mil. My house is looking mighty damn good right there. Damn! And it is probably equally as nice inside of here as it is inside of there. Luxury, luxury. Under 10,000, probably 8 million. <laughs> I choose this any day. I was just gonna ask you if you liked our house, but there's nothing but your butt. Disco! Do you like our house? <laughs> you like our house? Oh my gosh, the link looks so good. I'm just waiting for the fireworks to just start going nuts around here. But we're not alone tonight. We got neighbors there, neighbors there, a big motor home there. Eddie and Monica are right there. The ones that did the spray thing on the roof of their van, they're right there. Yeah, seems like a great place to hang out for Halloween night, but we're gonna let you guys go. Thanks for watching today's video. And if you're new around here, we kind of film just like everyday van life. Whatever goes on in my day is what you get. That's it. We try to do this every day. I know I've missed a few days here and there, but damn it, sometimes a guy needs to take a break. Peace out, guys. Cheers. Nice. <laughs> <laughs>